standing in the landscape, which was nothing but humps and bumps, um, about um, 30 years ago. Uh, but the archaeologist, uh, Dr. Richard Brewer, um, excavated this site um, at the end of the 1980s, early 1990s. But um, I, I've got a massive bone of contention with that archaeologist, and I'm going to say it to get out of the way in a moment. But first, Man. I'm going to say this um, they didn't know, but that wall sticking above ground level was in fact the original Roman wall of the Basilica. They thought it was just a normal farm boundary, um, but then they found out that it's a Roman wall. And you can imagine, down to the foundation level, um, that's about nearly three metres in height. That bit there is two metres. So this was already standing, but they, obviously this is a Basilica. But the bone of contention I've got with the archaeologist Richard Brewer, um, and he knows this, that was still on that wall, about a metre and a half in height, okay? And as the year went by, and the year went by, and when they finally decided what they were going to do with the site, they lost all the plaster. Um, and I absolutely, I was absolutely livid about that. I was really hurt. We found this site, we've got all that really well preserved plaster, and we lost it. So when anyone ever comes to you and says, well, we don't, we didn't have any of this stuff surviving in, uh, from Roman Britain. Um, we do have this stuff surviving from Roman Britain, it's how, but it's how the archaeologists treat it. And that time Richard Brewer got it wrong um, and um, I've never let him forget it. So in other words, when you do find archaeology and you can't do anything with it or preserve it, you have to cover it up, exactly what they did um, in the 1920s and 1940s when they were excavating here, when they found Roman mosaics to protect them they would cover them up after the excavation. Right, Is he and... The oh, no, that's Stuart, my mate oh, Stuart, no. Stuart. So what I'd like to do is, I'd like to take us into the Basilica building. But before we actually do that, the walls of this building, you can see over there, uh, are standing over two meters in height still. This building would have had the ground floor, it would have had the um, first floor, second floor, it'd been a huge structure. The Basilica building in London was about five times bigger than this one. It was so big in London that by the 350s they had to demolish it because it was so big there weren't enough people to use it. Okay, because the Basilica building was a great record office, was a great tax collecting uh, building, it was a place the courts would be held, unless sitting in one of the courtrooms, follow me. 